Good afternoon, everyone. I am Dr. Neeraj Raghani. I am a cardiologist practicing at Zenith Hospital, Amravati. And this is to let you know the innovations happening in the field of cardiology. And Merrill, as a company, bringing up the new products to help the patients more and more. We are going to talk about today about the bioreabsorbable scaffold, that is a stent. Though it is not called as a stent, but a scaffold because it's a device. Now, what's the good thing is with this is it get absorbed or dissolved over a period of time. So over a period of time, there is no metal in the blood vessel. So as there is no metal in the blood vessel, the chances of stent restenosis are less. So nowadays we are seeing more and more young patients are getting coronary artery disease. And these young diseases are more lipid rich, more fibroatherotic rather than calcified. So these kind of lesion needs good dilatation and good lumen area to have the good blood, blood flow. But we don't need the stent to be there for the long time. But the only problem with the first or second generation stents were the high chances of re-stenosis. Even very late, late and very late, late instant re-stenosis is the Achilles heel of coronary angioplasty and which is the need of uh, like patients coming back and back again. So to deal with that, nowadays we are having biodegradable or absorbable stents. And from the Merrill, they have a biodegradable uh, scaffold, uh, which is a very good stent and uh, which, which we can put in young or middle aged patients. Uh, and it get dissolved over a period of 18 to 36 months and uh, giving us the natural coronary arteries over a period of time. So. Treatment zaruri hai is the saying from Merrill and we should treat each and every patient to the best so that we can give them the best possible care in long term. Thank you very much.